Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Banished. As always, let's continue. Uh, for you it's been a day, but for me, or maybe it's been, this has uh, been a second day for you, but for me it's been three days since I've played. Uh, if you have been listening or watching uh, my other videos, because I don't remember if I talked about it in Banished in particular, um, the past few days have been incredibly busy for me, as far as personal life stuff is concerned. A lot of, uh, my sister's getting married, essentially, a lot of stuff to take care of. I have to be a lot of places, get fitted for a lot of things, etc, etc. So, the past couple days, over the weekend, um, I have been not around, so coming back to this is gonna be a little bit like, okay, what was I doing? But I think, you know, Banished is one of those games that, in particular, I can kind of come back to and be like, Oh, I'm fine, I know what I'm doing, or I know what I'm doing. Um, so that's what we're gonna do. Go back to it. So we have a lot of people. Um, we did take in, if I remember correctly, Nomads. Was it last episode, I think? Uh, so that's always a good thing. What do we have? What are we, lacking a person? So we'll go ahead and put this person here. I just want to make sure there are jobs around for everybody. Um, we are building a church, a chapel rather, over here. We have a school going up over here. That's right, that's right, that's right. And we are just building, building, building. So that's what I'm gonna continue to do. Build away like crazy. And it hopefully will go very well for us. It looks like it's already going pretty decently for us, so... Um, our town is growing. It looks like we have a lot of our students becoming adults again. Farms are doing well. Our food situation is... decent. Um, I think it's time we start plopping down some other farms. So I think I will. I just want a whole other farm field around over here. It's the goal, anyway. There we go. Couldn't see it there for a second. And one more over here. This hopefully will give a lot of people over here jobs and so on and so forth. And we have a merchant that has arrived too. What do you got for us, big guy? Pumpkin seeds? Sure, we'll take your pumpkin seeds. We will happily take your pumpkin seeds. Overpaying. An additional 20, and we, what, do 10 for this? So we just need to sell them two of these. Boom, trade. I'll take your pumpkin seeds. We'll start growing some pumpkins here. Because we don't have any, it'll be good for our health. Variety of food and all. And do I want to do much else other than wait? We could start planning. It's always a good thing to plan. Actually, that fits perfectly. I love it. And the other thing I'm going to end up doing is roads. We need to work on our roads. Can't go much else up there. Kind of stops there. And we'll get some houses over here. Like so. We'll pause them. Um, and what I want to do is build a different type of style of town over here. Instead of going block by block do like strips of houses. You see what I'm saying? And then have houses all along it like that and then build more houses and more strips of road and so on and so forth. I think that'll be cool. This over here, this little storage barn is actually gonna throw a kink in the works for a little bit but we should be alright. We'll see how it goes. I'm just experimenting with different types because then when I play on my own or I start a mountain harsh playthrough I'll have a good idea of how I want things to work. Uh, let's get about five more miners in there. We're gonna need them. We're low on iron as it is, so you might as well throw some more people in the mines. Get out some iron for us. How many mines do we have? Do we have three mines? We'll have one do coal. Two do iron, one do coal. I feel like that's a decent decision. We have, uh, somebody working over here. Yeah, good. Everything looks pretty friggin' good. How's our houses looking? Three, three. This is a lot of people there, actually. So we'll go ahead and start building a couple more houses so people can move out. Good. Church is almost done. Uh, all the materials have been dropped off there. Almost all the materials have been dropped off over here. Now, I do have a... This is, like, um, going to be hard to build a road behind because I do have a stockpile over here. Um, I'm trying to think if maybe I don't want to do it on this end, but we'll see. Just thinking, just thinking about how I want to do things out loud. Kind of musing. Why is there so much stuff just dropped over here? Somebody died. He froze to death. Uh, okay, that's unfortunate. Everything, why is there so much food over here? Why are people just dropping food here? 
Anybody know why this might be happening? Hmm. Bizarre, bizarre, bizarre. Died of starvation. It's not a big surprise. It's gonna happen until everybody has the jobs near where they live. In particular, actually, I'm curious. Sorry, I take a sip of my coffee there. Um, where a lot of people live. Eh. Eh, they don't live that far. I mean, the houses are gonna be nice, but... Chapel's done, so we have another people over here. Might want to put another graveyard over here somewhere. Somebody said I should put a big old graveyard back here. But I'm not gonna... I think that's where we're gonna stop as far as farms are over over here are concerned. Have eight farms, because it's already cutting into our Forester's Lodge slightly, and our Gather's Hut ever so slightly, so... Gotta be careful not to overdo it. Um, builder building. Three students. Man, they went to town with the kids. They had some happy, fun times. If I do say so myself. Food is definitely still declining, which does worry me a little bit. Uh, this person is starving. Let's take a look. Zoom in. Where are ya? Well, let's see where her house is, and then we'll... Wow, she works way over here. These people... I'm assuming she lives over here somewhere. She's gonna die before she gets there. There's no way she's not, unless she barely makes it. So she... So what was she doing? Building? Why is she way down there? If they work over here... They don't work far. Pumpkin. Uh, corn, sure. Doesn't really matter. Cabbage. Uh, and what else? Whoa, 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 this looks small. Hmm. That looks incredibly small. Where is food? There it is. And peppers. That's good. Did I see a merchant pop up there for a split second? I think I did. Yep, I did. Iron. Oh, please, all of it. Iron. And how's our stone? Stone's good. We could probably take it. 2,000. Let's take it all. So what, like 950 would be what? Not enough space. Really? Not enough space? How about now? Really? That sucks. I really want the iron. Whoa, nomads! That's a lot of nomads. Look at them all, just surrounding the house. 71 nomads. Oh boy, do we want to risk it? Can we do it? Like, we don't really have the food necessary. Let's do it. Let's effing do it, everybody. Let's go crazy. Alright. Build. Build. We need more. We're gonna need farms. We're gonna need all kinds of stuff. People are gonna die of starvation. It's gonna happen. I fully expect it. Get another farm up here. Um, we'll get some vendors up. Just to get people jobs. Build. 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 We're gonna lose so much food, if not most of it, or all of it. We'll see how it goes. 
Um, we'll definitely max out most of our miners. Get them in the mines, get them doing stuff. Um, I mean, we, we, gra we grabbed eight more um, farms, so I'm hoping that's going to help out in the long run. I don't know. This is going to be interesting. This was a gamble. This was a huge, huge, huge gamble. One that I think we'll be able to look okay to do. I'm just kind of carefully watching. Very nervous. Got another teacher. So that's good. We'll get a job. See what we can do, man. Let's see what we can do. He's still there, huh? I really want it, man. Just, I wish I knew. I wish I knew wh why I don't have any enough space. Uh, let's get some stone cutters in there. Let's get five stone cutters going. We're gonna just get people to work. ASAP. And then we can go ahead and, uh... Do some stone collection. Some basic stuff. Uh, influenza has broken out. Hopefully we'll be fine. We do have a hospital. Let's double check it to make sure it's in working order. We do have people there. We should be good. And winter. So we'll see the so food. The, the winter's gonna be the big test. How's food gonna be? Is food gonna be bad? Is food gonna be good? Are we gonna be all right? Are we not gonna be all right? We're gonna want to get a hospital, I think, up and running over here too. Um, put on like workers' row over here. I don't know where I want to put it. Could have put it at, like no, nope, can't. Say so put it across the street from there. We could put it over here actually, which. And that's actually uh, in an area I don't want to do it. Let's go ahead and put a hospital down. It's going to be needed. Pretty badly. Just to take care of people over here in case things do break out over here. Also going to want a well over here at some point, so we might as well do that. Go ahead and plop a well down. Food is all right. We're making it through winter, and then summertime we should be okay. Seventy-one people is a lot, though. It's dangerous. I'm surprised I did that. I'm surprised I gambled it. We're so low on on some materials. We can't even finish some of these houses. Oh, this one's almost done. Might want to pause this one. Hmm. We're doing all right. I apologize for that random bout of silence there. My phone's been going bonkers. I'm trying to make it go quiet, but the silent function on it doesn't work properly. It just goes into crazy vibration mode. There we go. I think I got it. Come on, houses. You're almost done. A lot of you almost done. Food? Wow, we might actually be able to support these people. Which baffles me. But we might be able to pull it off. Uh, 71 people are going to be alright, I think. They're freezing for some reason. This house is just freezing. We have coats everywhere. I don't see why you can't just pull it out. Let's go ahead and do... Wool coats. Wool and leather. Let's go ahead and make you have you making both. Nope, phone's still loud. God damn, it's annoying. <sighs> Look at all our supplies just drop. Massively. Get more stone cutters. As our builders come offline, we can put them as stone cutters. That's what I'm going to end up doing. Stone cutters and miners. Our homeless situation is taken care of. Houses everywhere. 
We're just low on uh, fire. Wow, we're low on firewood? Really? We have firewood cutters everywhere. It's a little surprising. Where well, we can't actually make any more tools. Hopefully the 286 tools we have will be enough. At least for a little while. Happiness is going up. It's like little ants. That's what I like. It's like little ants just running around in their little ant farm. While God watches over them and judges them. That's me, by the way. I wonder... We have another merchant here, but before that... Could put another farm right there. I think we will. What do we got, merchant boy? Seeds. No thanks. So I wonder if pumpkins only are done in autumn. Or if they're done after the summer too. Look at them, they're like oranges. Oranges that grow out of the ground. Interesting. Oh, somebody's dying. Crushed by a rock. Alright, that's the manly way to go, though. That's alright. I accept that death. Get more people chopping up some rocks. Can give them orders to take care of these rocks up here. Oh, that's iron? Oh, that's good. Let's take it. Rock over here. Just depleting the area of as much resources as possible. This is maxed out on students? Jesus. That was quick. That's super quick. Extra builders. Needs extra miners for later. Don't know if I'm ready to do it yet. Let me do that. Go ahead and grab those too. Everybody's looking good. I'm happy. Happy with where things are right now. Take a sip of my delicious coffee. Chocolate pretzel stick is the flavor of this coffee. All doesn't taste like chocolate, though. I've been trying different flavored coffees over there, and they all taste the same, I've decided. Like sadness. No, not like sadness. Oops. Here we go. Go ahead and do that. We have a lot of rock over here, too. Probably get rid of it all. Put, put it to good use. Iron, too. Go ahead and do that. Give the orders. How are these houses? They're still absolutely packed full of people. Like, incredibly so. 25 and 25 now. It's good to see so many people actually be able to work their jobs. The problem is we're going to have that dirge of death again at some point. People are going to die and then come back and then die and then come back. It's that, a never-ending wave that we have. That's good. A couple, only a couple people there. Still... Some of these houses are very, 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 very full. Oops. There we go. Vendors we could probably bring down by five. Uh, was... Magdalene to the vendor was stabbed to death. Was she robbed by one of my own villagers? Is that what I'm gathering? One of my own villagers robbed her and killed her? It's a little unnecessary. Why would that happen? That's horrible. I've never seen that before. Poor Magdalene. Magdalene. Whatever. God, that's awful. Are we completely full on schoolhouses? We really are. We need more schoolhouses. We need to educate the children so I don't start stabbing people. Christ. That's horrible. That's horrible. That is just awful. Um, where do I want the schoolhouse? Right next to the mines? Um, could do it like here. Right next to this area. Um, uh, this is kind of just out of the way. I think we'll put it over here. Put another schoolhouse down here. Right there. 
Alright, and we'll wrap this episode up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. We're actually doing really well. That gamble of the, the 70 some odd nomads is actually not a bad gamble at all. It seems to be paying off quite nicely. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying it. And as always, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.